Watch your toes. There she goes, see? Pull that string. Me and Zoe going on our first ride together. Check her out. She's up there on bail. Side of the camera. They're like, ooh, give me a kiss. They like riding in pairs. Was it fun? Yeah. You want to learn how to tie a quick release knot? Just like this, loop it. And with that loop, you take this part and just run it through. And that way when she pulls, it stays tied, but if you got a quickly release her, you just pull on your rope. Oh, you already got your, calm down. She wants another one. She's a good girl. Okay, back cinch first. Okay, front cinch. Careful, because she's cinchy, so you don't want to put too much pressure on her belly. She doesn't like it. Now you just pull it. And then when you tuck it away, bring it up behind and back the row. Just like that. And you can even do this if you want to. Make it all fancy like. Keep it tucked Happy. away for good. And that way when you're ready to ride again, take that out and put that in your Cinch. Mm, you don't need. You through. don't need to do all that. Oh, Shoney. Yeah, we can figure that out later. Watch your toes. There she goes. See? Pull that string. Why you freak out, huh? Strong of you. You okay? You about pull my whole barn down. That's why it's important to tie that quick release knot so when they do that you can just go up and pull that down and free them up so they don't hurt themselves. A horse can break its own neck by pulling like that. I've seen a video of a horse uh, snapping its neck. Well not like snapping it but like popping it. Yeah. It's bad for them. That's why you got to tie those quick release knots. Well, I'm talking about like, more than like tied to anything. Like, really? Yeah. 